All right, guys, welcome back to CJ Boats. I just got done with a mile swim. I'm training for a triathlon. So we just went out there when I swam out to those rocks, back and around, and it was about a mile when you when you go on the shoreline. So that, I am gassed. I need to I need to take a quick shower, and then I got to get to work, get in my clothes. I'm actually kind of running late now. I look at my watch here. But business is booming. We opened up yesterday, and we made quite a bit of jet ski sales. Those went really well, and then we, we had some more rentals. I think I got my change of clothes in my desk up here all right there we go i gotta just drop my skippies and then we should be good looking for a good place here i'll just do it in this corner there we go all right good nobody saw me so we have a lot more we have a lot more things in the shop and we have we officially i like where everything's at in the showroom we have a jet ski so we have sea jet ski and then we got the pontoon the tritune so it looks really good right here i think it looks beautiful we did move this truck up a bit because it was blocking the boat the boat was blocking one of our doors that we needed access to and then i got another tritune in everglades with two Yamahas on the back and she looks good. Now on the side here we got our big old cruiser and then I think another Everglades on the other side so I kind of like where it's at. We still have more things to come into the storage but the place is looking good. I'm always going to keep my bass boat here. I, I like to either go late uh, early in the morning or late at night when I have time to so there we go. Let's go ahead and open up the door. This thing is so this thing was not cheap. These are very expensive but it's super nice when we move boats in and out. All right there goes Ian. I think he put a diesel in that Cherokee. At least it sounds like it. I need to ask him about that. Ian, you need help getting stuff out of the back here? Yeah, I got these boat traps. Can you help me with these? Yep. Yeah, absolutely. There Dang, we go. Man, yeah, they're for heavy. the jet skis. Yeah, they're okay. for the jet ski rentals. Okay, perfect. I just got done with a mile swim around the lake. Nice. That's pretty good. There good uh, physical ac activity. That's right. It wasn't all the way around the lake. I think that would be like 10, 15 miles, but just uh, a little corner. See any boats on your way over? I did. One of them hit me. Or, or, and it, some kayakers were kind of by me too, so that was good. But yeah, yeah. There, there's quite a bit of traffic out there this morning. Nice. Where do you want these? Uh, let's Here. see. Where should we put them? I don't just know. Just put them by the tool, tool uh, okay. boxes. Cool. All right. So uh, these are the new rentals. I think we just got them in. Yes, sir. Uh, yes, sir. They look good. A couple of them. Yeah, a couple of them are sponsored by the squad, I guess. Okay. These are pretty cool. Yes, sir. Yeah, no, those look really good. And I feel like if it's kind of nice to have different ones, and maybe we could maybe we could price up the squads a bit, you know, just charge them yeah, a few sure. extra, like twenty bucks an hour extra or something. Yeah, maybe maybe they will pay. We'll see. Uh, and then yeah, we just have six of them, so we're gonna probably lease them out at fifty bucks an hour. I think I think that's a good rate. That works. That works for sure. That's that's gonna be a lot of fun. We should take them out too. We should we should probably run every single one of them, make sure they're good, and just you know run some fuel through them. Yeah, look behind you. The sheriff just pulled in. Oh, the sheriff? I haven't seen I haven't seen any boat any water patrol have you no I, I mean it's a new ramp so i mean maybe he's coming by for the first time true 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 where isn't it on the north side they have uh i, I mean what do you even call it the water patrol you know more than i do Ian. yeah border patrol they got a uh, sheriff they got all that kind of stuff okay i think he's going through that through the front hey sir howdy How's it going, man? Pretty good. So, are you, are, do you need anything help with the uh, with the boat? I mean, we have the new boat ramp. We have uh, new display boats. Uh, what are you in here for today? Oh, I'm just curious on where the best spot is to launch at here. Yeah, we there's two new. One was one was provided by the state, so you can go on that. And then one is a private one that we let our customers go on. the 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 most north one is the one you can go on. It's right next to a little uh, shack. So. All right. And so you're the sheriff. My name's Spencer, and this is Ian. We're the salesmen here. So nice, nice to, meet to meet you guys. Yeah, you too. So did you guys just open up today? Yesterday. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, we we do a lot of rentals, and so you're gonna see a lot of that on the water. And we got all that paperwork figured out. And then yeah, we do new boat sales, some used stuff, but not right now. Alrighty. So yeah, if you ever need anything, man, if your boat breaks down, you need a part or you need to tell, just just yell at us. Alrighty. Good American. That's right, man. You have a good day. You too. Well, he seemed nice enough. Yeah, I mean, uh, maybe we'll have to get on the water with him. What do you think? Yeah, that would be pretty cool. That would be really cool. So I, I was looking at this earlier. I, I like where everything's at in the showroom. I think it looks good. Yeah, I threw this pontoon in uh, earlier this morning. You can kind of take a look at it if you want to climb up here. You dust her off? You spit shine her? Yes, sir. It's morning. So, I mean, I got a bar back here. Look at this. Got a faucet and everything. When people come in, you just start passing out the drinks. Yes, sir. Coronas. That's right. All right. Let's jump off here. Right, let's let's get in the water, man. That'll be fun. Okay. Yeah. The squad jet skis, those have uh, 20 horsepower more than the other ones. So uh, you want to go big? Let's do it. Let's do it. You right. wanna, should we, let's just run the forklift. It's almost easier. Yep. What we should do too, Ian, is we need to get like a, just a small little like sub, maybe a little bigger than a subcompact, but just like a compact tractor that we can run around with. Yeah, maybe like a T6 or something like that. Yeah, something that can go a bit faster. Now the forklift's nice and all, but it is a little slower and the ramps yeah. are kind of far away, so. Yep, for sure. 
Yeah, I mean, we could probably hook up something with like a tiny New Holland T6. Maybe I'll try and pick one up this week. And, yeah, uh, see if we can do that. absolutely. Yeah, if you can get a used one, honestly, like that's the way to go. We don't need new nice stuff. So yeah, and I can put a bucket on the front too for like boat straps and moving stuff around the yard. Yeah, yeah. I feel like we would use that. Put pallet forks on it. I mean, we already kind of got forks on this, but yeah, there's just a sure. lot of utility in it. It'll be helpful for uh, when we're doing like engine swaps and stuff like that. Yeah, for sure. All right, guys, so this is how we've been doing it. We just use the forklift, bring it all the way out here. It looks like the sheriff's already got his boat out there, so he's figuring that out. And if you guys enjoyed today's video, let me know by smash the like button. It's always appreciated. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. We're getting close to 300K. Hopefully, we can hit that here by, like, around Christmas time. That would be that would be really fun, especially because we do a lot of live streams around break time, and I'm off of school and stuff, so it gives me a lot more time to do live streams, which are always fun. All right, there we go. Here's the ski. I'm just going to run it up on the sandbar, kill it real quick. There we go. She looks good. Good, and I'll just keep the trailer over on the side. All right. Yeah. yeah. I was going to say, like, we got to need that tractor because it is a ways away, but Ian's already got me covered. That's good there. And then I'll just keep the trailer right here. What's nice is we have so much open space. And once we get a lot more people, a lot more just like general guests coming down and people start using like more, we kind of got to paint some more lines because I feel like we're going to, we don't really have too good of boat uh, trailer parking. So we'll figure that out. All right, Ian, let's get these pushed off here and let's get going, baby. Yes, yeah, sir. I, uh, I have a spot we can head to. There's two spots actually. Uh, party cove before we go because there's no radios on these things uh and then there's actually this new construction mansion yep and uh the construction company the real estate they said we can check it out if we want i mean yeah. they got a pool it's pretty sweet that would be yeah that'd be awesome and you know the guy who owns it or construction yep, company just built a brand new waterfront mansion the thing is really cool i think it's like four million dollar construction so four million out. he's gotta yeah. come by the dealership and pick up a boat man yeah so i think take it right here i mean we can kind of zoom over there okay oh wait there's the sheriff too oh yeah hold on go slow yeah yeah don't go don't go too fast watch for traffic too yeah once that sheriff leaves we'll uh we'll put these bad boys to the test yes sir all right right here party island this is his uh this is gonna be a guy's playhouse some billionaires playhouse jiminy christmas man is that his pontoon out there yeah that he i think he bought that from like uh rcc on the water or something like that i don't okay. know some hey, our competitor is, are you sure we can be on here uh yeah this is new construction the guy the guy comes here once a look year look at this man look at this you, you have a shoot hoops uh i can try from the three point i didn't farm sim let's see let's see okay is that the ball I, 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 they're deflated these. they're deflated here are some new ones over here are they yeah they need some air back in them yeah he probably had never used them so they just sit there uh oh uh oh what is this sheriff guy doing i don't know sheriff what's going on hey you guys have permission to be over here yes, yeah sir. oh yeah yeah all right just making sure yeah you know, no. tony the real estate guy no i haven't met him yet okay well he he owns his property so we're good all right just making sure yep thanks sheriff thank yep, you you guys have a good one so spencer this guy likes to play uh this like call of duty game or something okay so he got this gigantic antenna behind you uh just for just for his internet that's his internet oh my we should somehow like bounce off that and use it at the yeah, use it CJ, at boats. CJ boats yeah 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 i mean that'd be pretty cool and then he's got some toys over here and then the house check that out yeah this is sick he's got two corvettes looking he's got like a little windmill these hedges on the side open bar what happens when yeah, it rains in cool. here i think he has chickens in the back too oh my goodness man this guy started to sound like Chow. The more and more you talk about it. I don't know if Chow plays video games, but... Story gets worse, Spencer. He's friends with Chow. He's friends with him? Yeah. Leslie Chow's his friend. He buys a bunch of chickens from him. Wait. Leslie Chow must have been through here. There's no chickens left. Oh, boy. He must have repoed the chickens. He must have repoed the chickens. That's right. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, let's jump back on the skis. We probably... I mean, it's okay that we're here, but we don't want to stay yeah, too long. I'm going to put my thing in sport mode and go fast yeah for sure all right first one to fall off wins all right all right let's see if we can catch them here guys i love the mirrors on here too those actually work pretty good i'm gonna throw around do some big donuts here that's my favorite and then go back oh i almost oh, hit well, him crisscross yes sir there we go all right let's head to let's head, either head to party cove yeah let's go there okay turn back around let's go to party cove real quick we'll check that out these things do not turn when we're uh when we're not accelerating because it's all uh, jet thrust Spencer, so, check out this castle right here. Yeah, no, that's really cool. Where's Party Cove again? I'm getting turned around. Uh, I think it's a left over here in this uh, area. I think it's a right. It's a right. It's a right. Right? Okay. Yeah, it's back by here. I think it curves around in here. Oh, okay. Yep, it's right over here. Hey, I'm going 86 miles an hour. Wait, Ian, turn around, man. The sheriff's what? right there. What the heck? What? Dude, he's gonna th oh, he's gonna think we just ran from him. Wait, his lights are on. Wait, are we in trouble? I don't know. He doesn't have a siren going, or do boats even have sirens? Should we run or just stay here? No, no, what no, are no. You hey. What are you guys doing? We we weren't doing anything. We we actually didn't even know you were chasing after us. Really? Yeah, we were coming over to Party Cove. We were flying, and 
And yeah, we never saw you. We, ne we never turned around. So you never heard any lights and sirens? Not lights, but you never heard any sirens? No, nope. I didn't hear any sirens right now. Or did you turn them off? I had them on. I, I, yeah. I didn't hear anything. Did you, Ian? I mean, it must have been at like the lowest decibel or something because I couldn't hear anything or the highest. No, I'm sorry, Sheriff. Once we saw you, we, we stopped. I didn't mean to run from you. And when I saw you, I was like, gosh, dang, he's going to think we ran from him. But we didn't. It was just a misunderstanding. Mm. But what did we do wrong? We can own up to anything if we did. So first of, all, first of all, you guys were speeding. There's a speed limit? You guys were driving very recklessly and going very fast. Uh, there... About that. Uh, my bad. What do you... Okay. All right. I'm sorry, officer. All right. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and write you guys a ticket because that we're... was... Were we in the no wake zone or something? I don't see what we did wrong, though. If there was other people on the water, that could have been a very like dangerous area. Like you could have endangered more than just you guys. Okay, like swimmers and stuff. Okay, yeah, yes. I get it. I'm. We're sorry. We're sorry. We're sorry. I'm gonna go ahead and write you guys a ticket, and then I'll let you guys be on your way. But I do not want to have to stop you guys again. Yeah, we, and we don't. Yeah, we're sorry. We're sorry. We'll make sure the people rent these too. We'll be okay. good. Right. Put uh, we'll put some uh, put some governors on these things. All right. Thank you very much, officer. I appreciate it. Yep. Just be safe. There we go. Yep. Thank you. Yep. I love these horns. Yeah, the horns are pretty cool, but gosh, that guy's kind of a stickler. What did he give you? He gave me a hundred eighty-three dollar ticket. Mine's only seventy-five. What? What did I do wrong? I think he gave you the reckless driving. Oh gosh. But All I right, understand. He, he never said that we were in the no wake zone. Like, can't yeah. we do whatever we want out here? I think I... these things might have illegal, uh, illegal chips in them. I'm not okay. sure though. And he probably radared us and stuff. But yeah, I I gotta go look at the law on those. I'm not too sure about that. But I wasn't gonna question him there. We'll figure it out. Yeah, he's new in town i guess we'll uh, let this one pass yeah we'll throw it at our, our financial assistant bolt yeah and we want to be nice to him though because i feel like he's if he's gonna be a stickler like he's gonna get everybody rents from us they're gonna go crazy oh this is the wrong ramp we gotta go to the other one Oh, yep. I'm going to get turned around here, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed today's episode. A lot of fun here at CJ Boats. Not too many customers. We had some this morning, but we did get to know the sheriff. So we're going to get these on back in the showroom, and we should be good to go. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you all in the next one.